Hello everyone, in this video I would like to give you an update of the latest COVID outbreak in China. Right now I'm in my compound and that's behind me what you see is the gate which is locked for all five days already and I'm not sure when we will be able to go out because we already did four tests. Yesterday we didn't do any tests and now Today we did again one more test and maybe tomorrow we will have further information of when will we be able to leave. Right there you can see a lot of people asking about new information or just getting some food and fruits and vegetables because the delivery guys are not able to come inside so you need to go to the gate to pick up your delivery. Here in this photo you can see the map of my compound and I got an information that in building number 112 which is right here got one confirmed case that was the second day of the lockdown and after that day we need to do all all around all again all the people in this compound need to do the test again and that's around maybe over 5,000 people and then we did it again and when we finish with the second round of two days then we got information that not all the people did a test maybe 400 people did not do the test at that time and that's why we need to do another round of testing and then we will see if we have no positive cases then probably our compound will be unlocked people are getting a little bit nervous and every day you can hear people shouting even though the gates are locked we can still see someone coming in and out and these people are maybe volunteers or work in hospitals but anyway we commoners are not able to go out until further notice the biggest difficulty at this moment is getting food ordering food online and you need to wait a lot of time and you need to pay big tips to deliver guys so they'll be able to go and pick up your food and bring it here now I'm going to show you the food and storage rack for the deliveries Okay, so here is the block D8 and on this side we can see the racks for delivery where they can put and then we go and get them. And on the other side a lot of people come in and getting their packages. You can see the atmosphere is quite loud and this is the gate that you cannot pass. Everyone shouting, this is the board with information. Back in the city all the public places like shopping malls, restaurants, cinemas along this closed you cannot access them but still there are some people who are able to move freely around the city they're not locked but i was not so lucky it seems and for now i need to stay inside and wait for further information tomorrow we will do another test and we will see how will that go now we're going to go to the second gate and to see how is the situation there here we are at the second gate and it's not so active here like on the the other one but still pretty locked and no one is able to pass this one is completely cut off you can see people playing badminton enjoying in sports but if you want to go out that's not possible only thing you can do is to wait for your delivery on this photo you can see the current numbers in china and shanghai is second city by the numbers of COVID infections in this latest outbreak so it's almost 1000 which is pretty high having in mind that before since the first main outbreak we had maybe spikes and in whole China we had maybe 200 300 max and then it went down and this is the first time we have like almost 3000 cases and they're spreading fast the peak is still not here in the beginning of March, people were sensing that something is coming. And that's why they went to the stores and bought so many different supplies. And you can see on these photos what was the situation in the beginning of March when I could go out. Now I'm coming up to the place where I want to show you the testing site. On this video you can see how it looked this morning. Every day four to five thousand people needs to come here and get tested. And this is some like a playground when they put this tent and every day we need to come here and get ourselves tested. And when the day comes that we are all negative, then they will open the gates. 
At this point I will finish my video. The weather is pretty nice. I will enjoy the walk in the sun a little bit. And we will see what will happen next. Until next time, Zai Jian.